President Abdel Fattah Sisi instructed the continuation of efforts to refine the Imam's experiences and enhance their capabilities to keep up with the pace of contemporary issues. President Al Sisi's directives came during his meeting with the Minister of Endowment, Muhammad Mukhtar Kuma, on Wednesday. Presidential spokesman Ahmad Fahmi said that the meeting tackled the latest training qualifying programs for new Imams set by a number of specialists in religion, social, human, and cultural sciences. Prime Minister Mustafa Madbouli headed on Wednesday the weekly cabinet meeting at the government's headquarters in the new administrative capital. During the meeting, Madbouli reviewed uh, President El-Sisi's directives to intensify efforts for a comprehensive transmission of government and its bodies to the new capital and to provide distinguished and digital services for citizens. The Premier asserted that a number of ministries have com completely transported to their new headquarters and assumed their duties. Meanwhile, Ahmed Bouli instructed to gradually complete the measures of relocating the remaining ministries in the administrative capital. Minister of Interior Mahmoud Tawfiq sent a congratulatory cable to President Abdel Fattah Sisi on the 10th of Ramadan occasion. In his message, Tawfiq expressed wishes of success and progress to the President and uh, said the occasion presented a memory of immortal epic battle which will remain in the nation's history. The Interior Minister also sent a greeting telegram to the Minister of Defense and Military Production, Mohammed Zeki, to mark the occasion. He asserted that the 10th of Ramadan will remain engraved in the history of the armed forces, which embodies symbols of sacrifice and glory. Meanwhile, Tawfiq sent a greeting message to the Armed Forces Chief of Staff, Lieutenant General Osama Askar, to mark the occasion.